Here's the question. Write down all the factors of the following. Here we need to write the fra uh, factors of the 20 and the 36, 60, 75, and 100. Uh, we have already discussed in the previous class what is factors and when we can say uh, the, a number is a factor of something or not or what are the factors of a given number. Right? Uh, here, so uh, first talk about the 20. Okay. Uh, what are the numbers that can divide 20 exactly are called the factors. Right, those number which can divide this 20 exactly are called factors of 20. If you see 20, this 20 number is divisible by 1 in 20 times. Similarly, this 20 is divisible by 2 in 10 times. Similarly, 20 is divisible by 4 in 5 times. Are you watching any more possibility? No way, there is not. Like, like 1 can divide this 20. Similarly, this 20 can divide this 20. Similarly, this 10 can divide. This 2 can divide. This 4 can divide. And this 5 can divide. If you do further, you might be thinking like this. We can, we can do more. You might be thinking like this. Like 20 can be divided by the 5. And then in 4 times. 5, you know, 5 can divide this 20 in 4 times. But do you know, brother and sister, this 5 and 4 have, we have already mentioned here. And in that time, we have, I think, discussed in a very good way. Uh, how to write the uh, factors of a given number. So here, you know, whatever I have circled, those all numbers are the factors of 20. Okay. So we always come in the U shape. I told you that time also, I think. So 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, and 20 are the factors of 20. Are the factors of 20. 20. Always remember one thing that 1 is uh, always the factor of every number. Every number. Any number you choose, you know, any number you choose in, in this entire number system, the 1 and the number itself are the always minimum these two factors. So every number at least contains two factors, which is 1, 1, and itself, the number itself. These two are always the factors, okay, in every number. Similarly, here we need to discuss about the 36, okay. So, what are the numbers that can divide this 36? If you see, you know, 36 can be divided by the 1 itself. So, in 36 time, and again, 36 is divisible by, so since 6 is at the end point, at the end point, you know, 6 is there. So, I'm sure that it is divisible by 2 also. So, 36 can be divided by the 2. In how many times? 18 times. Uh, I hope you know the table of 2. Well, and again, 36 is divisible by 3 also in 12 times. Similarly, 36 is divisible by 4 also, you know, in 9 times. And uh, now you tell me, are you watching any more possibilities? Means more numbers than this? Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4. If you're going to write more, you know, if you want to write here 36 divided by uh, 9, Oh, sorry, one more is there. Yes, 6. 6. 36 divided by 6 in 6 times. And now if you do, like 36 divided by, after 6, if you do by 9, then you will get repeated. So 4 is being repeated. So there is no need to think about this because already that number has been repeated. So now this 6, you know, uh, so 6 is repeating. You don't have to write 2 times. And then 9, and then 12, and then 18, and 36, you know. Again, in the U shape, as I said, these are our factors of 36. So all the factors of 36 are 1, 1 is always everywhere, you know, and then 2, and then 3, and then 4, and then 6, and then 2 times 6, you don't have to write, all right, 9, and then 12, and then 18, and then 36 itself. So these are the set of numbers or set of the factors of 36 okay so these are the factors of 36 these numbers can divide this 36 exact way in exact manner there should not be any remainder there will not come any remainder remainder will be zero every time only but these numbers will divide 36 that is why these numbers are factors of 36 okay now another number is 60 okay so let's talk about the 60 what are the numbers that can divide that uh, 60 in exact way Okay, so if you talk about the 60, 60 is divisible by 1 in exact way. 
in 60 times similarly 60 since here is 0 so possibility is, is possible is there to divide by 2 because it's an even number so 60 divided by 2 if you see is 30 so it is divided by uh, 2 as well as 30 similarly 60 divided by 3 20 so 60 is divisible by 3 also and by 20 also similarly 60 is divisible by 4 in 15 times right so 4 as well as 15 can divide the 60 Similarly, 60 is divisible by 5 also in 12 time, you know. So, 5 times 12 is 60. So, 5 as well as 12 can divide the 60. 6, if you divide 60 by 6, uh, you'll get 10, all right. And then 60 divided by the next number is 10, right, and you'll get 6. But, 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 what? Because these things is being repeated here, see. So, means how many numbers are now uh, uh, factors of here so this one can divide the 60 similarly 2 can divide 3 can divide 4 can divide 5 6 10 12 15 20 30 and 60 these all circled numbers are factors of 60 because these numbers can divide the 60 without any remainder so factors of 60 are 1 2 3 4 5 6 10 12 15, 30, and 60. Oh my god, a huge number. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So there are 11 numbers which can divide the 60 in exact way there without any remainder. Okay, so these are the factors of 60. And the last one, I think, no, 75 and 100. Okay, so what are the numbers that can divide 75? What are the numbers that can divide 75 without any remainder? So 75. Any number first it is divisible by 1, so 1 can divide the 75 in 75 times. And since there is 5 right at the last 5, so whenever there is uh, at last 5, so you need to think that that is only divisible by 5. So 5 75 can be divided by 5 in 15 times. I have already told you to learn the tables till 20, so I hope you know the table till 20. And uh, any more possibilities? Yes, 75 can be divided by. 25 uh, you can write here 3 it can be divided by 3 in 25 times any more possibilities no I'm not looking well so if, if you revise it you know one you can give like that is uh, that is uh, you can write here 25 say if I can divide by 25 in 3 times but that gonna be repeated here alright so we're not going to write so 1 5 3 25, 15, and 75. You know, again in U shape, you can say here also in U shape. So uh, these are all actually, uh, uh, these are these circled uh, numbers are the factors of 75. So 1, 3, 5, 15, 25, and 75. These are the numbers, right? The six numbers, I think, 3 and 3. Yeah, the six numbers can divide the 75 without. Any remainder, you know, so that time remainder will be zero. So these numbers are the factors of 75, similarly 100. So can you find out for the 100? Well, I'm giving you for the 100. Try to find out. You know, after after a certain time, you will be able to write these uh, factors uh, easily. Like if you're writing here 1, you can write here 100. You know, so 1 can divide this 100 in 100 time. Similarly, now 2 can divide this 100 in 50 time. Similarly, 4 can divide this 100 in 25 time. Similarly, 5 can divide this 100 in 20 time. Now, choose another number. Yes, uh, another number for the 100 is 10. 10 can divide this in 10 times. But it is repetition, so now stop it. Okay, so these are the factors which can divide 100. 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, 10 20, 25, 50, 100. Like this, you need to choose any number you have. Now, I'm giving you one number, uh, and you need to quickly find out the factors of that. Any number, suppose, uh, suppose I'm giving you 24. Okay, so what are the factors of 24? You need to say. Now, you know that all numbers are divisible one. So the first factor of 24 is one, so, but one can divide this 24 in 24 times. So one as well as 24. Both are the factors of 24. Next one, since here is 2, so it is an even number and even all numbers are divisible by 2. So this 24 is divisible by 2 in how many times? In 12 times. Now this 24 can be divided by the 3 also. 
right? Uh, because uh, you have learned that in the three table, three times eight equals to twenty-four. So three can can divide this twenty-four in eight times, all right? And next one, four can also divide in the four table also table of four also twenty-four comes in six times. So four times six equals to twenty-four. Now, do you see any more possibilities? Five, no, six. That it will be repeated. So see from one. To 24. These are the possible factors of 24. Like this, you need to find out. Okay, if I'm writing here 30, how you'll write it? Okay, now I'm telling you here, like if you have 30, definitely you know that one can divide this 30 in how many times? 30 times. And next one is 0, so it is divisible by 2 also. So 2 can divide this 30 in 15 times. Okay, and similarly now, 3 you have, 3 can divide this 30 in 10 times. Okay, now another number. Uh, I don't think any more number we have. Yeah, I have 5. So 5 can divide this uh, 30 in 6 time. And uh, if you write here 6, it will be repeated so you don't have to think more. So these are the factors of 30. Right? 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 10, 15, 30. So like this you need to find out what are the factors of any number. Uh, first, you have to do till you don't understand in this way. And once you learn, you can write quickly, you know, after a certain practice, uh, you'll be perfect and you can easily find out within a minute, you can find out factors, you know. So, we'll meet in the next video. Goodbye.